everyone, I hope everybody is doing well. Um, it's a random vlog, so today we're going to be trying four star pizza um, with tax VAT. Pizza is not cheap in this country, so for 22 euros 45, which is like around 25 dollars, you get 14 inch garlic bread, garlic bread, dips, and you get two toppings on your pizza. So we're going to review this. I'm serving, I haven't eaten in four hours, so it's intermittent fasting. Um, yes, yeah, so I can't wait to show you what this is like. I don't know how many calories is in it, but I'm guaranteeing a 14 inch. It's around, I'd say a little over 1500 calories. Then the garlic bread would be around three, 400 calories per garlic bread. And then the dips are around 60 to 100 calories, depending on the dip. So on the dips, we've got sriracha. I mean, of course we got the garlic dip, which garlic dip is just like, Wow, beautiful. So I can't wait to show you what this is like. And next week, I'm gonna do Domino's. Um, I'll try uh, Pizza pizza Hut. Um, I'm not a really big fan of Pizza Hut. I don't know what it is, but the dough just tastes weird. The sauce, it kind of feels like really dry and rubbery. And then the week after that, we're gonna try a classic Italian Napolini pizza which of course you have to do it in a correct way. You can't call it a Napolini pizza if it's not done in the proper Napoli way. So anyways, once the pizza comes, we're gonna go on this with a smashing vlog. So I hope everybody is doing well. Keep it up guys. Let me know what you're doing for the weekend. And of course, when I was in America, I'm gonna say first time in New York, first time in the United States, first time out of Europe was just unreal. Watching the plane come into um, New York was absolutely stunning. And when I went into New York, I took the train from New Jersey Journal Square. And for a ticket, it's $2.75, which is actually really cheap. And it takes 10 minutes on the Pat Metro, which is probably the cleanest metro in New York. And it takes you directly to the One World Trade Center. And as soon as you come out, you basically see the One World Trade Center and all the buildings compared to Ireland. It was just like, you felt so tiny, um, but I loved it. Like I'm gonna be going back in November to see my sister cause she moved over with the husband and the kid. So food over there. I'm surprised I didn't put so much weight on. So while I was there for the four weeks, I had the gym. So if I was eating something that was probably, I shouldn't be eating. I had the gym just to work out. Um, but M&M's in America, oh my God. I absolutely love America for the sweets. Um, like it's actually really good. Probably the favorite M&M's. I should have reviewed the M&M's cause I ate so much. Um, it's probably the peanut butter, the caramel, the pretzels. They didn't do the crispy M&M's, which is, I think it's only exclusive to Ireland. Um, but the, Fudge brownie, oh my god, wow. And you could buy it, I think it's like roughly over a kilo for about 10, 11 dollars with tax, which comes uh, to around nine, eight euros, which is actually a hell of a lot of a deal. And if I try and get them sent to Ireland, if I try and order through a website, it's costing like a hundred dollars, so it's not cheap. So my sister's friend is going over to America, so I sent her a bit of money just to bring me back American sweets. Um, so if anybody knows where I can get American sweets, like big bags of M&M's for extremely cheap, just let me know and I'll review them. Uh, yeah, so these pizza vlogs will be once a week because if I do them like every day, I'm not gonna look like this. I'll put all the weight back on. But if anybody is like, oh, I don't wanna eat this. They're probably in the gym. They're like, I'm not gonna eat this. Give yourself one day out that week to enjoy what you want. Maybe do it on your gym day so you don't feel shit. And probably eat it before the gym. Give the body a bit of an hour to settle the food down. Then walk to the gym. Do your regular workouts. Um, and then, you know, just enjoy yourself because it's about a daily lifestyle challenge. Uh, but I can't wait to get this pizza. I'm still waiting on it. It's currently 2.26 in the afternoon. And yeah, I'm starving, haven't eaten since 10. So it's like I gave my body enough of time. I had a small breakfast, 
just enough to keep the body functioning where it's not eating its own muscles because you know i have to look after my italian muscles um but i'm so hungry so i'm hoping this pizza is good domino's they didn't have the deal that i wanted for the price range um domino's in this country has just gone up so much but compared to america the one thing that i love about domino's it it doesn't feel as fatty it doesn't feel as oily and heavy on the stomach when it was in america you got such a better deal for the pizza they had so many promotions and um, you could buy like a 12 two 12 inches for six dollars each which is after tax in euros it's like around five euros and for a 12 inch pizza and um, we only do like a seven and nine eleven and a half and a 13 and a half so if we compare a 12 inch to 11 and a half over here you are saving so much money in america and um, but i'm really looking forward to this now i don't have a patreon so if you do want to um, like support the channel i will link the paypal if you still all you just have to do is just watch these videos i'm not gonna ask subscribe or any of this bullshit so if you still just watch the video it just means more than enough so anyways once a pizza comes then i'll start the vlog because i'm rambling too much but um let us know what you're doing for the day yes we got the pizza so i'm using the iphone 12 and um, 1080p 60 frames front camera so let us know how it looks got the pizza now i didn't realize that four star pizza i t believe is actually an american pizza brand um, and i think they only have locations in ireland as well um, so let's see what this is all about let's see if it's any better than domino's Uh, so we got the pizza now i went with the pizza with jalapeno buffalo chicken chili flakes tin base and of course we got the garlic cheese bread which i fucking love uh, of course we got the garlic herb and we got the sweet chili sauce so let's try these out so of course we'll do the garlic bread and um, we'll, we'll try it without the sauce garlic bread Let's see what this is all about. It's definitely fresh out of the oven. It's nice and warm. Uh, good texture. You can definitely tell it's nice and doughy. Nice. You can definitely taste the cheese in there, which I actually really like. Mmm. And of course, we need the garlic and herb sauce. They don't make it easy when your hand is like kind of oily. <laughs> and anger levels. And I just squirt myself. All right, so we got the pizza. Uh, let's do a review of the 14 inch all together with delivery 22.45. All right, tin base. Uh, well, I think it's kind of lacking the sauce and the cheese, um, but try without the sauce. It's actually not bad even Definitely taste the chili flakes. Definitely the buffalo chicken, which I love buffalo chicken. The jalapenos gives it like that extra burn, which I love. I love chili pizza. Um, let us know what pizza toppings you like. Okay, that's actually really nice. The garlic and herb dip is actually really lovely. Okay, so if you only have 22.45, I'd definitely get this meal, 14 inch, two garlic breads, or you can change it for other toppings, but I'd definitely get the garlic bread, so much nicer. Mmm. Wow, this is beautiful. Alright, now we're going to try the sweet chili sauce. 
Okay. I think this one is it's much easier to open. So that's what it looks like. And this is what the garlic herb looks like. All right, so do the garlic bread with the sriracha chili. Okay, so the sweet chili, it's kind of like that um, sugary taste. It's kind of more of a liquid taste than um, like the take taste you want with chili. Um, it's all right, it's not too bad. It's not as chilly as it was um, as I wanted. So I'm definitely going with the garlic and herb div. Mm. All right, it's actually not bad. And it did come 20 minutes earlier. So it saved me from dying. Um, all right. Mash it in with the garlic. Mm. Okay. It should have given me a bigger tub. Mm. Well. This is the tin crust. If you want to take the can, um, that's what it looks like. The sauce is kind of lacking with the cheese, but you can get a soft crust, which I think is a, an extra two euros. Um, so that's it. Um, but this is great. Love it. Mm. Mm, this is actually really lovely. Of course, we have to do the garlic bread. Now, I did get two garlic breads because I don't like the wedgies. I don't know, they kind of feel like the ones you can buy in the shops or the stores. Um, so there's no point getting that. So, garlic bread. This is actually really, really lovely. Okay, twenty two forty five with tax delivery. This is a bargain. I, I'm not complaining. If you want me to try and reach out to KBD Production, do a massive food review. Is all the way in Canada, but that'd be probably an epic vlog. Um, but yeah, garlic bread. Cheers. As as Cam would say, scratch it. Sniff it, the rest is all mine. Mmm. Mmm. This is beautiful. Let's go for another slice. Now the pizza kind of feels like it's kind of, as I said, it's kind of a little dry on the sauce and on the cheese, which it's all right. I'm not looking for tons of cheese on the pizza. Um, if I was able to get more toppings, I would have done the mushrooms. Uh, I was able to get chicken jalapeno, so I would have done mixed peppers. Um, mushroom, I love mushroom on pizza, I do. And for anybody that puts pineapple on pizza, man first and all this spread off, amen. Please, please don't ruin the pizza, okay? Oh, this is. Mmm. Mmm. Alright, guys. So I'm gonna just end it there because it's gonna take way too long to finish all of this. And um, I hope everybody's having a wonderful day. Let me know if you just want me to probably do a live stream every Sunday with food. Uh, let us know what you'd like me to review next McDonald's, Burger King, or something. Um, so this will be probably once a week or once every two weeks because I have to look after the body. I can be putting so much junk food into the body. Um, but like, don't even like, just watch the video till the end. And I hope everybody's having a wonderful, wonderful Saturday.